Aloha guys. Yeah, I'm not even gonna lie. Majority of the sharks that I come across all have hooks in them. I see more sharks with hooks in them than I see clean without hooks. I wish I could remove the hooks, but putting my hand near a shark's mouth and a sharp hook is not a good idea. Also, trying to yank something that's lodged in their jaw could further hurt their jaw. We see so many negative effects from fishing. This broken jaw on this shark's mouth is definitely from a fishing injury. One thing I can do is go down and cut the lines shorter. This will create less drag and less chance of getting tangled up for the animal. It's not just sharks either. Any marine wildlife has a chance to get entangled in fishing gear. This was one of the most sad moments for me in the ocean when I saw a baby dolphin entangled in fishing gear. We of course tried to help and called the proper authorities. Guys, the best way to help prevent this is to give up seafood altogether. This will prevent the fishing gear from being in the ocean in the first place.